How's it going guys? This is Luke from Coffee House and today I wanted to make a video about something that I think is really, really useful in a lot of different applications and that is this guy. And what we have here is the Hario Air. The Hario Air is a plastic, nice little handheld pouring device that really mimics the action of a gooseneck kettle for a lot less than what you're going to spend on a gooseneck kettle. You see the fellow products, their stag kettle is going for about, I think, $150, $160 right now, which is a lot more than one of these guys, which retails just at $17.50. What I think is unique about this is it provides you a most needed function in the coffee world without having to jump into something that's so expensive. The barrier of entry, you know, to the specialty coffee world at home is reduced when you introduce something like this. And whether or not it's amazing, we'll find out. For the, for the price, you're really able to kind of maximize what you're able to do with your coffee, your water, your existing coffee setup by adding something as small as this. So today, what I'm gonna do is I wanna talk a lot, a lot about kind of what the applications of this are. And then also, we're gonna brew some coffee and we're gonna test it out, taste it, and see the results. That being said, let's jump in. So talking about applications of the Hario Air, I think the one thing that we really wanna consider here is the portability and the durability of a product like this. It is plastic, um, unlike a lot of different coffee makers and things like that. The Bonavita kettle or the Stag kettle are obviously metal um, and not portable quite literally at all. You're not gonna be able to take out one of the Bonavitas or the Stags into the woods to go camping, but you can obviously take one of these. The question is obviously, how do you boil water? You know, these are two very different products that have kind of the same function. These are obviously electric kettles, so you're able to plug them in, boil your water right there. But when you're camping and using something like a jet boil, you're not, you know, pouring a jet boil or a cup of water that's boiling over your coffee isn't going to be the best application. So you could pick one of these up, which obviously there are markings here that allow you to measure the actual amount of water that you have in here. So you might not even need the, the scale for this part, which is cool. And then obviously, you know, with this gooseneck design here, you're able to mimic kind of what this does here at a fraction of a price. And, you know, for me, with this Bonavita specifically, this pour is with the force of a thousand suns, where this you can control the flow a lot better since it is an open unit here. Um, I'd be interested to see how this works with maybe latte art or something like that as well. So the one thing that I really wanted to talk about with this and the one kind of main takeaway that I took with this is the application of this in a cafe or a business setting. This is something that isn't really talked about when we review home products like this, but I think this is very, very important for cafe owners, baristas, and people that I'm talking to to listen to. This, I think, takes your cost to set up a pour over setup in your cafe way down. When you start building a pour over bar or want to introduce pour overs to your menu, you start looking at something like this or the stag kettles as one of the main cost draws that you're going to come into when you set up that spot. Having obviously your water boiling at all times is the most important part there. And obviously these will do that, but for 150 bucks a piece with the stags, that's gonna add up very quickly when compared to $17 here. And there's one thing I think you want to think about. When you have a cafe with your batch brewer and all of your setups there, you already have access to instantly boiling water, usually at that kind of perfect temperature. For a cafe owner, I think it'd be really advantageous to just buy a couple of these and just use your batch brew hot water tap. Um, I mean, it just completely kind of nullifies the need for a product like this. And this taking up so much space, I think this is great because it can fit right under a counter no plugs obviously and for baristas who are moving quick it has those volumetric measurements there so you're good to go right off the bat um, i mean overall the cafe applications of this for the price are endless this i think is a great value for cafes who are you know making pour overs on the side but it's really not their main focus so next we're going to jump in we're going to make a brew with this hario air and we're going to compare and contrast the taste And of 
course, this coffee is going to be great. The application of how you pour your water the, between these two is really not that much different at all. Um, it's really more so about your grind and your overall extraction. So what I did is I did 20 grams of coffee at a 1 to 15 ratio. So I measured right up to this 300 milliliters line and went ahead and poured. I had great control over the pour, maybe not so much the consistency of the pour. You know, for $17.50, you can't be here to complain about the consistency of the pour, especially since it's open-ended. It's going to allow you to really have more of a variable flow control overall. And I've seen a lot of criticisms for this. People talking about how this compared to a kettle, an electric kettle, does not hold a candle to it. But I don't think that's the purpose of this. I think this is one of the most important gadgets we've seen in coffee in the last couple of years. It's because of the ease of entry into the specialty coffee market. For $17, there's nothing more valuable than something like this. There are still so many people pouring coffee with a actual boiling kettle or even a pot of water um, in some cases. And these people are not going to spend $150 out the gate just to get a kettle. This is something that I think a lot of people will spend money on and make great use of at their home. It allows so many shortcuts in the coffee world, whether it's weighing water with a, you know, with a $200 scale or it's heating water with a $200 kettle setup. I think this allows people to adapt their existing setup to something that makes amazing coffee. I like the idea of the flow control and having a steady handing is obviously a little bit harder with this, but I mean, you're able to really control this when you pour because the plastic here isn't getting as hot as, um, you know, something like a metal. Like I could never place my hands on this and go ahead and control that. Obviously the weighted handle, on these and specifically the stags uh, are better, but this isn't a comparison, a direct comparison to that because they're so different. I think this is a very functional kitchen tool in more ways than one. And I think this is something that we're gonna see a lot more people using in wholesale, large volume cafe settings as well because of how cheap it is to adapt your existing setup to. That being said, I am absolutely floored by how usable and functional this piece of coffee equipment is. And for the price, there's really nothing more valuable than this. I mean, if you get this, a plastic V60, you can spend so much more on your grinder, which is the most important part of your coffee setup, in my opinion. So, I mean, yeah, save that money on your kettle. You know, you, if you can transfer just your boiling water to here and maybe get a thermometer if you wanna be specific, this is really, really amazing. And I've seen a lot of people dog on this. Um, for not being as good as a kettle, but obviously it's not as good as a kettle is. Um, it's 10% of the price. I am absolutely in love with these guys. Um, we're gonna carry these in the shop soon enough. I'll let you know when that time is. But if you don't, for anybody who doesn't have a kettle and doesn't wanna spend the money on a kettle, go out and buy one of these, even if it's not from our shop. This is one of the coolest gadgets that you could ever have in your kitchen for coffee. Uh, it makes amazing coffee and you can spend more on the grinder, like I said, which is super important. Go buy one of these, you know, I, I'm not sponsored by Hario or anything, but I really do enjoy this. So I'm Luke from Coffee House. Thanks for tuning in and uh, let me know what you guys think of this. I would love to hear about your thoughts, your reactions to something like this in comparison to a kettle, but also in comparison to just what your coffee tastes like when you buy one of these versus pouring a, a tea kettle or a pot of hot water over your pour over coffee. Um, thanks for tuning in and yeah, I'll see you next time.